In this class we are going to discuss about uh, access 3 code. As the name indicate this is access of 3 to the BCD code. For example, if you are having any number in BCD by adding 3 to that BCD you are going to get access 3 code. For example, if you are having 22 in BCD the access 3 code for this 22 can be obtained by adding 3, 3 to each and every digit. So that means, so for a 2 to BCD, if you want to get any access 3 code, you need to add 3 for each and every digit. So the access 3 code, you need to write for 5, 5. So that means, so you know that the BCD code for a 2 2 is 0 0 1 0 and 0 0 1 0. This is BCD code. To get access 3 code, you need to add 3 for every digit. You are adding 3 for every digit. So you are adding 2 plus 3 means you are going to get 5. So you can add like this also 0 plus 1 1, 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1, 0 plus 0 and that carry you are getting 1 0 plus 0 0 like this also you can add to save some time I am directly adding. So you also make these changes like you just simplify by using 8 4 2 1 this is simple right I am just adding 1 uh, 2 plus 3 I am going to get 5 means I know the binary for 5. So you just get binary equivalent in BCD addition. So here 0 plus 1, 1, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1, 0 plus 0 plus 1, 1, so 0 plus 0, same I am getting like this only. Here I am writing directly means I am saving some time, this is very important for gate like exams. So this access 3 code is important for one mark uh, questions, they may ask like this, what is the access 3 code for so and so BCD number. We have to uh, add 3 for each and every digit and we have to say this is the access 3 code for given BCD. For example, anyone ask could you, this is the access 3 code for 22. This is access 3 code for 22, just we need to add 3, that is it. For example, anyone ask could you, what is the uh, access 3 code for 25.35? What is the access 3 code for 25.35 or they given BCD code and they are asking what is the access 3 code for that BCD. Same number they given in BCD code that means 0 ones and they are asking what is the access 3. Just decode into decimal and you just add 3 for each digit. Each digit you just add 3. So 5 plus 3 you are getting some 8, 3 plus 3 you are getting, so 6 here, 5 plus 3 you are getting, 8 here, 2 plus 3, 5 you are having. So 58.68 will be the access 3 code for 25.35. For this you are decoding, 0, 1, 0, 1 is nothing but 5, 8 means, so here 1, 4, uh, 3 zeros will be 8, 0.6 means 0, double 1, 0, so 8 means again 1, triple 0. So if you have any doubt, you just decode 8, 4, 2, 1 for each digit. So you will get 5 and here at 8 place you are having 1 means 8 like that. So this is 58.68 which is excess 3 code for 25.35, 25.35. So now we will see the BCD numbers and access 3 codes. For example, for 0, what is the access 3? For 0, what is the BCD? So 4 zeros are the BCD code. So access 3 is, so see here, this is number. So this is BCD code and this is access 3 code. So here for 0, BCD code is so just 4 zeros. Excess 3 will be 0 plus 3 that means 3. 
So, 0, 0, 1, 1 will be excess 3 code for 0. Now, if you want excess 3 code for number 1, so for this one you have to add 3 in your mind. So, for BCD 0, 0, 0, 1, but in excess 3, for 1 you need to add another 3. So, that means for 4 you need to write. That is it. We are not doing anything. Just adding 3. That is it. Adding 3 and whatever value got after adding 3, for that we are writing binary or BCD code. So, here 2. For 2, 0, 0, 1, 0. So, there we are going to write. So, 0, 2 plus 3 means 5. For 5 you have to write. So, like that we can write any number in excess 3 code from BCD. For example, if you want to write any 12. In BCD can you write 12? Yes, you can write 12. But you need to take minimum of 5 digits. For 1 you need to take 0, 0, 0, 1. For 2 you need to take 0, 0, 1, 0. You can take out these last 3 zeros. And a minimum of 5 digits is required to represent 12 in BCD. Now come to XS3. So here how you can represent in XS3 means again for each and every digit you are adding 3 and you are going to write the code for XS3. In, the, in, in this way we can represent XS3 numbers and in uh, further classes we are going to uh, deal with XS3 arithmetic that means XS3 addition and subtractions.